Now, Mr. Crockett is a 2024 supernatural horror that tells the story of a former children's TV show host. <laughs> who is demonically resurrected, who is kidnapping local children and murdering their parents. Ah, uh, come on, say it. Open up, open up, Kevin. I guess force feeding doesn't feel that good. Oh, huh, Kevin, fine. Now we pick things up where the Harpers are having dinner time and Kevin, the stepfather to the young Darren Harper and husband to his mom, Rhonda, Kevin comes home and insists that Darren eats his food, to which Darren doesn't want to eat. I know what you're waiting on. Eat up. So Kevin becomes annoyed and increasingly angry. And at this point, he's fussing, he's cussing, he's violently throwing tantrums. You want to be treated like a fucking baby? I'll treat you like a baby then. No. Eat. I'm full. I said I don't eat. Want and around this time, Rhonda is unable to bear what she's hearing. So she goes and lock herself up in her bedroom to try to drown out her husband's incessant outbursts. But that's not the only thing that occurred because as viewers, we start to see the lights flicker, the TV static increases, the characters from the TV show that he paused start to take notice of Kevin's actions toward his son. And as Kevin's forceful attitude towards Darren increases, we as viewers begin to see this supernatural figure start to climb out of the television set and then the front door opens. <laughs> And Kevin looks around and this very same character that was on his son's TV is now standing in Kevin's living room. Who the fuck are you? Language. Who's ready for a second course? I mean, it's Mr. Crockett in all of his glory, but something is off. Because while Mr. Crockett still has that same lovable smile, it's in the eyes. The eyes tell a different story. I mean, there's hurt. There's anger. There's a vengeance behind Mr. Crockett's eyes. Not <laughs> to confuse as to how a TV show character is standing in his living room, Kevin insists that Mr. Crockett leaves, but Mr. Crockett refuses. He does instead hands Darren a large roll of cotton candy that seems to create a sort of facade for Darren because what happens next isn't going to be pretty. Dessert for the young man who ate all his veggies. Wow, awesome. <laughs> because Mr. Crockett possesses supernatural abilities. Abilities such as summoning demonic pets, dream manipulation, and even matter manipulation. So he summons one of his demons to restrain Kevin and then attempts to teach Kevin a parental lesson by forcing Kevin to eat a plate of food full of worms, maggots, and slime. <laughs> You haven't cleaned your plate. But Kevin refuses to eat the food. So Mr. Crockett slices Kevin's stomach open and starts to shove platefuls of food inside of Kevin's stomach, thus knocking out his entrails. Yummy, yummy, for your tummy. Baby, <laughs> got to finish all your food. Come on, let's go. And we go. Oh, go in there. But to further teach Kevin a lesson, he shows a very hot clothing iron inside of his stomach as to give him a daily dose of necessary iron. Don't forget your iron. That's a very good idea, Mr. Chair. <laughs> While this is happening, we see the young Darren enjoying the world of Mr. Crockett he's created for him to see. And Rhonda comes back into the kitchen to witness the horrific scene being done to her husband. A scene that we as the audience don't see, but one that makes her absolutely lose it. Who's the man now? <laughs> now, I know this is just a small time streaming movie, but I think this character, Mr. Crockett, has the potential to be a legacy horror villain. But hey, that's just me. What about you? Now, this video is sponsored by my Patreon supporters. Thank you for your support. And God bless. The Rewind. The Rewind is our exclusive membership section. And by joining the Rewind, you'll receive exclusive content not found anywhere else. You'll receive early releases, video shout outs, behind the scenes footage and photos, unreleased and unedited kill scenes that we can't show you on YouTube, plus special commentary from yours truly, Said Talks. So join the Rewind today by clicking the link in the descriptions and in the pinned comments.